Hello YouTube, King Strike by here with yet another product review of the 454 Big Block Clone. Uh, as you can see, it comes in a very nice package. Uh, it comes with a screwdriver and some tools. And let me show you the atomizer itself. 454 Big Block. Uh, it does come with the drip tip, but from what I can tell, the drip tip is not the same as the original. Because the original doesn't have an uh, air hole all the way through, they only have the holes on the side. But this one, I guess when they made it, they actually drill all the way through. So, so it's not a direct uh, one to one for the drip tip. So that's enough about the drip tip, let's get to the atomizer. The top comes off, and then... Uh, actually, how does that come out? Yes, I think I need a mod to get this out. Actually, no. My fingers is good enough. And as you can tell, it is the four poles one. Or not four pole, but this is the positive pole, I believe. Yes, this is the positive lead. And the whole bottom is negative lead. So you need to take off the four screws. And then when you're wiring it, it does have the, the four poles. Or, or the dual side hole, so you can uh, coil up to four different coils. And does have the airflow control. So simply pop it in, and then you can adjust for the number of air holes you want. And right now I do have it on one, two, three, four, four sided air holes. And the, bo the bottom just pops back in, or the other side, yes, like so. And the top goes back on. And here's the drip tip. The drip tip is really tight. So it, it, it's like the original where you can just pull it out. But the only problem is it's drilled all the way through, as you can see. I guess it's a pro or a, as for some if you don't want to take it out all the time in order to drip. So there you have it, the 454 uh, Big Block Clone. Uh, please like, comment, and subscribe.